I've been suspended from every major social media platform in the last year. The other day, I was suspended from Reddit. For what? For quote unquote hate speech. What was the hate speech? What was the horrible thing I said? That Black Lives Matter was a hateful Marxist organization that wanted to disrupt the nuclear family, which in the past was literally stated on their webpage, the disrupt the nuclear family part. The fact that they are Marxists is well known and admitted to. And hateful is an opinion that I have. But that is considered hate speech. The problem with this is that you have the blue-haired Taliban in charge of deciding what is and what is not allowable language. What is and what is not an allowable opinion. It is not the public square. It is a private entity owned by the woke who have affirmatively placed themselves there, whether through the founding of the company or through usurping the power structures that be in their way up. And the challenge that we have as a society is that when you limit the opinions, then you have to at some point believe that everybody is monolithic in believing the woke nonsense. When that is the only approvable opinion allowed on a platform and everything else is either shadow banned or deleted and or banned, then even in private conversations based on the fact that there's negative feedback for a certain opinion, one is less likely to state it. And thus people become hypnotized into believing one narrative. And this is a horrific thing for our society because what needs to happen is that the best ideas bubble up to the top. It is possible that somebody's opinion can be swayed or changed. And there needs to be pushback against the continued hypnotization of the masses by allowing only one opinion because there is such a thing as social proof. In other words, that's a psychological principle that what everybody else is doing must be the right thing. So for example, in 2006, that was buying real estate. Everybody was buying real estate because everybody else was doing it. And this is something that has been going on in an the animal kingdom, in humans forever, because we are group animals and we seek protection of the group. So when you have one stated opinion, and that is the only thing that people are believing exists because everything else is being neutered on social media, then they come to that belief and they become hypnotized. So by owning the channels of communications, by owning the public square, what the social media companies are doing are limiting the amount of available information, the number of dissenting voices that could possibly sway somebody or keep somebody from being hypnotized into the group think. And that is the challenge, and that's why we need laws regarding social media that states that this is the new public square and not just a private enterprise that owns the airways. And yes, there will be things that will be built like Rumble and other social media platforms, but it's almost impossible to have the same network effect as the other ones have have had that got in early. So there is a massive challenge to that. So this is one time when this libertarian is in favor of some form of government intervention to state that opinions must be allowed. And it's not that there's not such a thing as hate speech, because when I look at the bit comments on my BitChute channel, they are often very nasty, white truly white supremacists, and awful. But that doesn't change the fact that these conversations need to be had and such voices need to be, with logic and reason, dealt with. I don't think that it's proper to delete anything but the most egregious of comments that are advocating for violence or that want to recruit for a terrorist organization. Of course, now the Proud Boys are terrorists, but Antifa is not. This is the... This is the logic of today's society. So I decry Reddit and the other social media platforms that have not only limited my voice, but have limited the voices that can be heard by the masses. And they're doing so intentionally in order to prop up one narrative. Guys, thumb up this channel. Join me at rumble.com, rumble.com. The link is in the description. And subscribe, hit the all notification bell. Have a blessed day.
peace out.